All right, so this is Google Earth, and uh, this is Antarctica in Google Earth, the program. And here we have some uh, some camera trails, as I called them, or, or artifacts in the photographs. So, so Google's over here, and they're uh, taking pictures with their satellite that's zooming over the South Pole. And there's these big white things happening, and I'm just going to say that that's an artifact, and then that's just sloppy camera man action happening. Which, you know, you'd, you'd think with Google being really rich and having really fancy, um, you know, engineers and scientists, they could get rid of that. But, uh, so, so be it. Anyways, and then they also have this little guy. Here's another one, a little artifact. And so you can start to say, well, okay, why, why are these white things showing up? Maybe, maybe there's something underneath it that they're, they don't want the public to see, or maybe it's just a camera flaw. It could be either way, right? And we got another one over here. And, uh, yeah, they're just kind of all over the place, especially in a place like Antarctica. I've noticed them a lot more down here. So, yeah, there's that. And there's also, this is what I really want to talk about, um, the giant uh, distortion in this picture, or the series of picture. Z. This very distinct um, scrunching in of the photograph, photograph directly on the South Pole. As you can see, it's just a total um, destruction of the original photograph that was there. And uh, you can see it really clear when you look at the inverted picture, which is what I've done here. It just, just took it and inverted it. And as you can see, it's just such a blatant, um, specific circle where they've dragged the photograph inward and uh, really sloppily um, just distorted the image for some reason, right? Um, so there's that. There's just this blatant uh, distortion of an image. And it's like, why would they do that? What is the motivation for Google to do that? And uh, I don't know. I've never been to Antarctica. I, I can pretty s confidently say that that is not what Antarctica looks like, um, considering that that just doesn't look natural at all. <laughs> so. We have that here on the South Pole, and then um, as we look around the globe, uh, you know, you get pretty decent images. You get images of the ocean that are, you know, loose. They're, you know, that's obviously the ocean floor or whatever, but, you know, just somewhat decent images. And then when you get up to the North Pole, you get the exact same effect again. And it really does make you wonder. It's like, here we have the exact same effect again. I tried to invert this, um, but it wouldn't. It wouldn't, or it, it didn't. It did not work how I wanted it to. It work. It, you can see it way more clearly when it's actually just normal. And it's just, it's just very peculiar that they would do that, that they would do, have the same <coughs> scrunching effect um, on both the North and the South Pole, as if there's something there that we're not supposed to see. And as you can see, when I zoom in here on like the direct North uh, Pole, there's this strange like ocean thing, but it's obviously that that's not like the real image. Like that's obviously not a real image. That's just some sort of strange whatever. Anyways, and uh, so you get all these random images and. Yeah, so the, the, there's just some strange phenomena uh, with Google. Now, this is this. What makes it even more strange is that they managed to take and put pictures on a sphere around the whole planet, right? Um, and they've been taking these pictures since 2000, 2001, right here. So for 12 years. Google has been taking these pictures and updating them and giving us, you know, a lot of very accurate imagery of the planet. Um, but here, right here, for some reason, they've decided to create this very specific distortion. And around it, you can see that there's relatively decent images, but right when it goes into this circle, there's this stretching effect of the images. It's just very strange. So, yeah, that's, uh, that's the peculiarity of uh, what Google is doing to, our, to what we think is going on in the South Pole. I mean, we just, 
when, when, when a company does something like this, they have satellites orbiting the Earth, taking pictures, and they alter those images, it changes what we think about the Earth, what we think about what the Earth is. And this is a pretty obvious uh, attempt to distort what we think the Earth is. So I don't know what is here on both the North and South Pole, but it's pretty obvious that there's something rather large that needs to be completely just not talked about, that just needs to have no, no evidence for whatsoever. So anyways, I hope you enjoyed this. Have a good one.